Hello Vani, we are in Chennai for what makes your home home with Vari. Are you excited? Yes, I'm super excited. Please come. Thank you so much for coming. It's a pleasure to have you guys here. Oh, thank you. So how do you usually start your weekend? Well, my weekends are very quiet. I start off uh, with a nice cup of coffee, very relaxed and then by around 7 I have a manicure pedicure and then around 10 I start cooking and I prepare for the whole week and it's very relaxed. That's how my weekends are, most weekends are. So what's the most sentimental item you have in your home? I would say, I mean I'm very senti about my house but if I had to pick one or two things then one would be this painting which my son got for me and the other thing I would say is this Gauri Shankar which my father gave me. Are there any DIY home projects that you've attempted successfully or not? When, like, when we built this apartment, I was very particular that my sentimental sarees, my delicate sarees are all kept in a certain way. So we came up this, with this wardrobe where I keep my delicate sarees like my Dhaka Jamdanis or Benarsi organzas and things like that on rolls like this. And all the other sarees which are embroidered and things like that need to be kept flat so that there's no weight on the top of it. So those are these sarees. How has it been starting Lakshmi and who would you say are your strength pillars? Well, it's definitely my children. At the age of 50 when I decided that I want to do something, they were the ones who encouraged and said, why don't we get into sarees? They've been great strength and, and it's been like 12 years. I couldn't have done it without my kids. I have a quick this or that for you. Dhaka or Kanjiwaram? Kanjiwarams are beautiful, Dakas are more comfortable so and classy, so both. Japan or London? Definitely Japan. Asian cuisine or home cooked meal? Asian cuisine. Do you have a quirky home decor item here? Yeah, I think when I travel I pick, tend to pick up things which look different and beautiful to me. These are the fat ladies. I pick them up in Santorini when a lot of people think they are a little obscene or Weird, but I think they're very cute and very cool. Do you have a movie collection or a book collection that you proudly display at home? Yep. I don't. I'm not a big movie buff, but I do like my the whole. I have the whole collection of Amar Chitrakatha, and I love going back to reading it once in a while. I pick up a book here and there, and these were like something I grew up with. Describe your dream home in three words. Always welcoming, cozy and comfortable. This is one of my favorite play spots in the house because I wanted a God space which was compact, nice and uh, anybody who's going to any room or coming out of any room have to pass this and I think that makes this space so much more beautiful. It's very sentimental for me. So Vani, what makes your home your home? Well, it's beautiful, it's cozy, it is very open, there's lots of light. When, when we built the house, uh, the architect said, uh, why are you putting a TV in the living room and the dining room? So given that I have an open kitchen, I wanted to make sure that the kids are around. So the kids used to sit at the dining table, do their homework, read, do whatever, or watch TV. There was some kind of... Uh, presence of everybody around the dining table or around the living room space. I like seeing all the greenery around. I have lots of plants in the house, outside, in the patio and then all around we have so much greenery. So I think it's a beautiful space and it's really, really something that's cozy and comfortable. And here's a little something from Vari. Thank you. It's so exciting. It was a very nice experience. Thank you for being here.